seven. Thank you all for coming into my YouTube video this morning. Um, so this is the first day of my internship. I'm so excited to learn and just just get like really familiar with the field of social work and how everything works. So the organization that I'm interning for, they help at risk children and children that have been in like foster care. They help them to get the necessary resources that they need so that they can succeed in their future. So if they're like in a rough spot where they need like um, food or if they need high hygienal products, things of that nature, they can come here and they can get that. Or even if they just need um, some guidance, that's what they can come to the organization for. So I'm so excited to be working because this is what I've been trying to um, get more familiar with. Since this is the field I want to go into, I want to learn more about it. So this is my chance today and I'm excited. I got here kind of early. Um, that's all right. That's all right. Early is always good. Um, so I'm going to sit here. I'm going to eat. And yeah, I'm gonna just wait until like 9 30. I think right now, what time is it? <laughs> Get over. Uh, this is like 8 19 or something. Yeah, I'm early. I'm like an hour early. So I'll check in with you all later. Hello everyone, I'm back from my internship, my first day, and it was really, really nice. Um, and the surprising thing to me was I didn't really know that organizations like that existed where they had assistance and help for uh, youth like that. And so I got there, I got there a little bit early. I was there like, I'd say like an hour and 30 minutes early. But it was okay, I just sat in my car. But um, when I got there, they had showed me around the resource center. Um, they showed me the area where they kept all of their hygiene products that they give to the youth. They showed me where um, they keep they keep like clothes. Like say like a student needs um, a couple of outfits for the week. They can come there because a lot of the youth um, that come are homeless and at risk. Or some of them may have went through um, sex trafficking. And so I have to correct myself because earlier I said that it was 12 to 24, but it's actually 18 to 24. So they deal with older, older youth. So they showed me around. They showed me the room where they have all the clothes and the shoes. Really nice. Um, they showed me the room where students can go and uh, hang out and maybe study. Um, they showed me it was a nursing room for sex trafficking victims and it was just really nice, a really, really nice environment and I, re I could really see myself working there. Um, but yeah, I was outside today and they had tents up and everything and um, they had where students can come in and uh, get lunch and breakfast and things like that. And if they needed any services, like if they needed um, housing or shelter, we provided them with information. People came in to help them. Or if they needed help on a resume, a job application, maybe they need help getting a, a ID from the DMV, something, we gave them information and we had staff there to help them. So it's really, really meaningful work. And I want to do a series more on social work and talking about it more. But um, I definitely think it's a field that I want to go into. And um, my mom and countless of other people have, have keep, kept telling me that it really does take a person to have tough skin to be able to do the job of social work. Because it's definitely not a, a easy job dealing with people, uh, with children that have been through such traumatic events and such early stage in their life so it takes a lot sometimes you might not always get the best results sometimes it's an ongoing process for a lot of people and I just say like if I'm going to go into this field I really have to make sure that I that I am giving myself boundaries and making sure that mentally and emotionally I'm doing okay you know but um, I will be giving you guys updates if you guys want me to continue this series on talking about social work and my experiences. I will definitely do that. But um, 
that's the end of my vlog for today i know i didn't record too much but i was this was my first day so i didn't want to record too much you know so yeah but i hope you all like this video make sure you like comment and subscribe and let me know what other videos you want to see so thank you and i hope you have a blessed day